hyperpenetation. How about that? We're going to call it hyperpenetation. Good morning. Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to do an all day wear test on this Dermablend Professional Flawless Creator Multi-Use Liquid Pigments. So let's read a little bit about this. This is one point fluid ounce, which is pretty standard for product. And this flawless creator has some great things that they say about it. But then I, I realized it was in a dropper, scared the heck out of me. Scared the heck out of me. I'm thinking pigments in a dropper, this can't be good. Okay, it safely covers imperfections, redness, hyperpigmentation, pigmentation and uneven skin tones. It's oil-free and lightweight, and it evens and smooths skin. Use with Dermablend setting powder for up to 16 hours of smudge and transfer proof resistance. Okay, I did not use the Dermablend setting powder. I just used my regular, say regular, I've got about six, Revlon Fit Me powders. And it says shake well, which I did. Multi-use wear alone, which I did today and you can mix it with your skincare finger blend or buff with a brush. Use one drop for minimum coverage, four drops for maximum. It is blendable, buildable, customizable, high performance pigments. Results you can see instantly. Dermatologist standards are fragrance free and sensitive skin tested, allergy tested. And I have to agree with everything they said after the fact. Actually, that was before the fact that I read all that. I used some drops on and showed you that it wasn't like too, totally liquidy on my little pan there, and which I was kind of shocked about. So it's not as thick maybe as what I would think of as a foundation, but it's not as liquid as when you get a dropper, you think really, really fluid. No, it's kind of more on the thicker side, less of the fluid, but you can use a dropper. I did shake well. I actually listened to directions once, which doesn't always happen. However, you will see when I put this on, half of my face, how much it really covers redness. Maybe it, not maybe, it does cover acne because I've got a little breakouts coming on top of the hyperpigmentation or the really red. And so you're, you're gonna be able to see how buffing it out with a brush no, I lied. I used a beauty blender. I used a beauty blender, buffed it out, and how different one side of my face looked from the other. And then you'll see me kind of tap out the rest of it. So I am pretty pumped about what this looks like. It pounced into the skin super nice. It's actually doing way better than my eyeliner that keeps trying to go down my face and I, it's already gone down my face once. We are gonna see how this baby sets up all day. I'm gonna be out and about. I've got some appointments I need to run to and a little bit of last minute shopping for the holidays I've gotta get done. And we're just gonna see how this performs all day. Okay, today we're gonna try the Derma Blend Professional Flawless Creator. I'm gonna shake these babies up. I'm gonna start out with my Scandinavia Makeup Primer Spray. Since these are drops, I'm going to use my handy dandy little tray here. I was expecting really liquidy. This might be a little bit more liquid than the typical foundation. This is supposed to have buildable coverage. I will say I wasn't expecting to get this much coverage after reading the packaging. To have this kind of coverage is exciting. You can definitely see a difference from my right to my left. That looks really good, really good. I'm hopeful for this foundation. Derma Blend, got my fingers crossed for you. We are at the eight hour mark and I've got a little bit of oil showing through. As you can see, my eyes have been agitated and watering like nobody's. Okay, so I took off my eye makeup and, but I didn't touch my nose. My nose is breaking up already at eight hours right there. I think for an eight hour day, I mean, other than my nose breaking up, my chin held on, and I started seeing some shine through. Again, it's just been eight hours, and I need something that's going to last before I get to work all the way through work. I did like, 
afterwards how much coverage so this might be a good foundation to mix in and see how that does with other foundations maybe to for that that nice coverage and maybe the other foundation will help it kind of stay put a little bit better but that's the end of an eight hour day I think that's the quickest I've ever done an all-day wear test it might be it might be all right so now I'm back to zero ground zero and I'm just gonna start all over thank you so much for watching this video using the derma blend professional flawless creator I'm not sure if you've had a chance to use it I don't know that I've well I haven't really searched the web to see how many people have used this but I'm really curious what your thoughts are regarding the all-day wear test put those below if you've used this tell me what you think I use the color 30N and it really just went well with my skin. This was a little bit darker in the, the bottle so I wasn't sure how well it would blend out but it blended really nice so totally thrilled about this little buy and I'm hoping, which by the time you get to this you already know the results, but I don't yet. I'm hoping this really works because I really liked how flawless it made my face immediately. So I've got high hopes for this baby. Let's hope that it doesn't let me down. All right, y'all. I hope you have a fantastic day. You have a choice to make it a great one despite what the world is going to throw at you. And goodness knows it throws a lot sometimes. Anyways, I hope you have a wonderful day. Kisses and hugs. Love you guys. Can't wait to see you in the next video. Till next time.